I was just wondering if you were at all aware that scientists, they actually discovered what they call a death pool at the bottom of the Red Sea. Now, death pool might be an extreme name for it, but this 100 foot brine pool at the bottom of the Red Sea, it actually does kill everything that swims into it. Pretty cool, right? Well, at least I think so. And there are only just a few dozen of these deep sea brine pools in the world, at least that have been discovered so far, but what makes them death pools? Well, it's the fact that they contain so little oxygen and so much salt that they're considered one of the most extreme environments on Earth. And they have been found in just three bodies of water, the Gulf of Mexico, the Mediterranean Sea, and the Red Sea, and they range in size from a few thousand square feet to nearly a square mile. These scientists, they're not only interested in their murderous tendencies, deep sea brine pools, they could lead to the development of new medicine, explain centuries of environmental patterns, and even shed light on the origins of life on Earth. In 2020, University of Miami researchers discovered a 107,000 square foot pool in the Red Sea by using a remote controlled underwater vehicle to explore the northern pocket of the Red Sea. And they saw that animals like fish, shrimp and eels would use these pools to hunt. These creatures would wait near the pools for animals who would venture in and who would immediately be stunned or killed in the process of their curiosity. Oddly enough, researchers believe that human life began in regions similar to these inhospitable pools. One researcher said, our current understanding is that life originated on Earth in the deep sea, almost certainly in anoxic conditions. Deep sea brine pools are a great analog for early Earth and despite being devoid of oxygen and hypersaline, are teeming with a rich community of so-called extremophile microbes. Studying this community hence allows a glimpse into the sort of conditions where life first appeared on our planet and might guide the search for life in other water worlds in our solar system and beyond. The Red Sea contains the highest known number of deep sea brine pools, most of them being about 15.5 miles offshore. But it was in 2020 where scientists found the first of these dead pools in the northern pocket of the Red Sea, just 1.25 miles off the shore.